All right, it's the run- rundown. It is uh, January 22nd, brought to you by Sim. What you're seeing is honestly how my brain works. Like, uh, now I got it. Back. I may never. No. It's wrong, right? 23rd. 23rd. Yeah, you're going backwards. Today's the 23rd. Nearly yesterday. <laughs> now Watch you're it. off track forever. Simply say. Until your birthday. So, simply <laughs> say. In February with all the 28th. Dude, days he didn't get. What, I mean, up. didn't he not get like January 2nd? Yeah. Right? I think I missed 9 11 one time. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> that never hurts. forget, and you forgot. Simplysafe.com slash rundown. Uh, Simply Safe is 24 7 home security, no contracts or catches. They believe the safest place on earth should be your home. More than 3 million people agree. Uh, thanks to Simply Safe, PC Magazine named Simply Safe both editor of choice and reader's choice for 2018. Protect your home today. Go to simplysafe.com slash rundown. Um, also, shout out, not shout out, but good luck. Uh, Alex White, fan of the rundown, starting chemo this week. Um, little known Alex White fact, even a little unknown, his brother is Ian White, who, ah. without Ian White, oh, I don't know here, Website because guy. he developed the first Barstool website. What is that, like, ah. powered by Ian White at the bottom or something like that? Maybe. Yeah, there was Literally always, without him, uh, we don't exist. It was a lucky break. He was very smart. His brother uh, diagnosed with cancer and going through the chemo, so best of luck to Alex. Um, bad segue to... Amen. Oh, amen. Uh, Mario Rivera, first unanimous Hall of Fame guy ever. People, I guess, are acting like it's a big deal. I didn't care about this story at all. You're out on the Hall of Fame in general. I don't care about Hall of Fames. Yeah. To me, the only thing, and I, I don't, I'm not, I couldn't be more out on Rico Bosco if my life depended on it. Um, he is. Happened? He's so. He texted me at 1 a.m. Is it about the Kelly Kapowski blog? So I found I didn't out. See uh, that? Time. I, I thought he was story. just texting me. No. I come in today and I find out he texted half the staff at 1 a.m. Rico Bosco's he head doesn't that, fit through the door. He, he thinks, thinks yeah. that he is. He's the worst. I, he's not the worst. Well, no, you he's know, pretty bad. Dave, you know, you know what's going on right now. He's halfway to a 50 burger on the hoops on the courts. On he's down. Minus 23 units. Jesus Christ! <laughs> he's got to be the worst ever, right? <laughs> minus 23 <laughs> units on the hoops. I haven't. I don't. I don't pay attention. Halfway to a 50 burger. <laughs> wow. Why are you so out on him? I, I. He's trying to take credit for the Patriots. And he's also just demanding that we all like. He's texting us like we have VIP service and we're all at his beck and call. 1 a.m. He texted me. I was trying to help him with that too. And now that I know he's bothering everybody, he I'll bothered like Keith, the Frankie, Kevin, me. I don't know who else he's, he's turning into a real son of a bitch. The, uh, <laughs> I mean, to take credit for the Patriots, it's, it's a wild it's move. Stupid. It's literally how, like, how does he literally say it? Like, don't worry, I'm gonna get the Patriots to the Super Bowl. <laughs> yeah, he, he was said like, it like, yeah. It's, we go to Super Bowl. Oh, no, yeah, no, he, he, I mean. I'm you, taking credit you can, for the fucking. You can decide which, which is more of a wild move. He took, he's taking credit for the Patriots, and then he tried to demand a thank you from me for uh, getting Wisconsin a win against Miami at the Pinstripe Bowl. Yeah. I don't fucking care, dude. Like, like, I don't care that they he, won he's that He's making game. a mockery. He's, he's a guy, you hear it a lot, he's jumped the shark. Rico, I've said Rico's no longer welcome on my program, Barcelona. Wow. He no. said, he texted well, me today, he said he might call in hat in hand. That's happened. Well, he before. he always he would have. He calls in hat in hand. Hat in hand he, issues he a formal apology again that he's outstepped his uh, uh, welcome. Because I'm still actually love surprised Rico. he didn't use like oh, Martin like Luther it. King to do that. He usually yeah. does it with like a holiday or an, or yeah, an occurrence where he says, friends, "I realize yeah. that some things are bigger than sports." Yeah, and yeah. All that shit. He, he's become his really, marriage was a big he, one. He was about to get married. I have he aired all his zero respect for Rico Bosco right now. Wow. See, I still love him, but he does need he needs he needs a reality. But, 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 but Rico, with you guys, and particularly you, is the greatest makeup and breakup couple sure. of all time. He'll be back, and you this will happen ten more times. Take, take credit for the Patriots going to the Super Bowl. But he'll call I in and say he's sorry. Dave, that's here's, it. here's why back. I'm not leaving Rico Bosco's side. I want to see him get to fi- the 50 burger <laughs> again, so I don't want to write him off because then I can't have fun with Does that. Does he still call your show? No. He's he said not he, welcome. He, like, I think he said he'd call Hat in Hand today. The flip side. Of what are we even talking because about? Because Mariano Rivera <laughs> got unanimous into the Hall of Fame, and he thinks uh, he hates Mariano Rivera because oh, he murderer. committed murder. He's a two-time. So he, he, is that double true? Hey, he, killed those, he killed those people in, in Panama. Okay, that's pretty much a fact. Allegedly. By the way, this. Uh, I by the way, I could care less about the unanimous. Well, it's thing. crazy that any the the unanimous in a weird way 
It's not as meaningful that Mariano Rivera. It's not like a big moment that Mariano Rivera did it. It's a big moment that all these fucking grumpy ass old white dudes are finally agreed. That's on what something. happened. That, no, but remember no, 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 the, no, no, the Maddox. Is, there was yeah. one guy who didn't vote for Maddox because he said he would not vote so for anyone sick. who played in that era. Right. Like Greg Maddox was what the happened, first unanimous it, it, Hall of Famer. It's, it's not that they have agreed. It's that they've gotten rid of him. Yeah, that's true. They, they, he, they, the Maddox this, guy's gone. This is not actually about Mariano Rivera. It just happened to coincide with Mariano Rivera being an immortal player up for ballot when they cleared out Correct. the budgets. Correct. So this is more about the Hall of Fame. Yeah. I think you're going to see it next year with Jeter, and I think you're going to see it a lot yeah, there's now. a bunch of guys who, like... Not, they, 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 not, not many murderers. Yeah, true. Two people. I don't know if I believe that anymore because Rico Bosco has zero credibility. So now I'm thinking he didn't. Did murder he actually anybody. murder someone? Yeah, because well, if Rico's saying yes, probably two pe- no. Two, two family members Ugi died Urbina. in his pool. No, he definitely like Ugif? he like set someone on fire. Well, Ugith had like people kidnapped, I think. Yeah, he's, right. he's a bad dude. Um, this story is kind of interesting. So a man thought his wife fucked with his action figures, so he took out an axe and started hacking up the entire house, and then called 911 on himself. Well, when you're out of control with an axe. Quiet on set, please. Quiet on set. Yeah, maybe. Uh, maybe. Fair, right? Well, action figures are worth they, they a lot of money. He kind of apologized after, too. He said he overreacted. Yeah, he called 911 yeah, on himself. Yeah, that's okay. That's He's like, to hand me up, is, yeah, hand yeah, up 911. I'm exactly hacking. I have, a, I have an axe. I'm breaking everything in my house, my car, because I the know, action figures were fucked. I want to know the dollar amount. Oh, well, it was clearly Star Wars figures. Right, something also, like that. And then if you lose one, like the whole, the whole set collection. goes it's down the set. drain, and the only, that's it. The only person he hurt is himself. He's going to probably have to it's fix all his, his shit. house. Yeah. yeah. I uh, once attacked one of my friends with a baseball bat because he was uh, dropping my baseball cards on the ground. Again, like valid one by point. one? Yeah. Angry rookie one cards? One by one. Or like, so I took a bat and I attacked him. I was like 12 when this happened. Full bat or like a mini bat? It was a metal bat. Was his name Todd McShay? No, Pete Woodfork. Yeah. Did you actually hit him? Yeah, Where? in the elbow. He was like our star player on the Little League team, too, so it wasn't the best move at the time. No. You're not uh, a team guy. Well, that's where you know Dave I, cleared a path for himself to be the star. He yeah. fucked with my, fuck oh, with my weird. baseball cards. Everyone baseball keeps cards getting... Were, baseball cards were very important. Back in my day, we had trade fests where we'd have like 12 hours. You bring all your cards, you lay them out, and then nobody would make a trade. <laughs> you just propose these trades, and nobody would make it for 12 hours straight. Um, Chapo, I like this move. So Chapo killed his cousin because he found out he called in sick, but he wasn't sick. Oh, so well, this is right up my alley. Right up my alley. But right the problem alley. is that when you're sick at Barstool, you never know what to do, so you're dead either way. Yeah, no, but if, 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 you come in, if you come into work and you risk getting Dave sick, he kills you. And if he finds out you're, you're slacking and you're hanging out at home and you're not sick, he T- kills you. T- Tommy Either way, you're dead. is yeah. sick. I have no problem. Get him out of here. It, we have some people here, the new breed. Like, I know Liz and Casey both love to, like, be here when they're sick. And it's disgusting. Yeah. But you would, but then you would get mad at them when I don't they're know, like, no, he, would I, cut, uh, he would kill everyone who's ever taken a vacation. I am. Yeah, that's well, like that that's, I know you're not we'd sick. Have, like, you're just enjoying yourself. Yeah. I don't get mad about sick. Yeah, vacation bothers me. Right. Yeah. Right. The man who <laughs> takes a month off in July. Yeah, to well, not I, take earned a vacation. No, I earned it. I earned it. How about yeah. this? You take off July. I take off June or August, and he takes off the Well, other the problem one. is... I won't get mad at you guys. Yeah, well, that's the problem. But, okay. but, but, Kevin, the problem is we, like, from back in the day, have had it, like, in our heads that we can't take vacation. Oh, if I took a month off, I would be the most... Come, way, new people world. come, and they're like, oh, we don't do three months and three weeks of vacation? Like, I still work when I'm on vacation. True. Um, I do. Nantucket videos. Yeah, they that's work. hard work. Well, now report... Fourth of July, America, wiffle ball, hot dog, dingers. It golden is. hour, yeah, or yeah. You, yeah. You, golden hour is a it's, one that's take, a franchise. ninety right. seconds, more bigger franchise than half the fucking people here do. Right. You don't think you don't think we see through that, Dave? That you created a fucking ninety second video and you're like, that's work. Yeah, it's it is work. <laughs> Look at it me he's standing. Look, I sit and I another brainstorm. Another addition. He's standing in front of the sunset. I'm gonna take a vacation in July, and I'm just gonna be like, "Hey, it's a new franchise. Big cat you, shits uh, on vacation." I, I mean, listen. I <laughs> <laughs> I'll just be on the toilet. I really here I am. Of guys, all people, I have, to tip, I have to tip my cap. All you do is eat pizza and sit in the sun. <laughs> That's your entire career now. You think it's pizza's fun? <laughs> me and Frank, you were in a car for an hour and a half today. It's, there's nowhere to go. Pizza's a grind. People don't see that. 
They don't. They don't see. They don't see. You should make a new vertical. Every yes. Time. You should make a new vertical <laughs> called "Driving to Pizza Reviews," yes. and it's you in the car driving, driving with to Frankie. Pizza reviews. Hey, driving Miss Frankie. What I do? Driving Miss Frankie is, is. How many people do this? I got car sick. I literally blogged. Here, I'll, I'll show you what. It, it, I'm no, glad we don't. You guys let's go to the next. No, 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 no. Who care? No, I care. I care. I care. I said. Yeah, no, I do. It's on the Yeah, yeah, I care. Where's the thing? Taking a long time to find <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, because I was looking. Sometimes long I do that. I'm in the wrong it. thing. I was looking at my text messages. I emailed. I emailed it to my guy. Uh, where's the, the oh, thing? Oh, you use the buddy system. Yeah. Here we go. Hey, hey it, this is dirt. While I'm in an Uber getting car sick. Damn. The Steelers have arrived. Oh, shit. The Steelers plane just Well, you're landed. not going to read this whole blog to us, are well, you? Well, it's on the thing anyways. Yeah. It's literally, the next, it. it's literally the next topic. <laughs> okay. What a segue. So what the a Steelers uh, tweeted out like we have arrived yes. to the Pro Bowl. That's Ridiculously crazy. That's a, that is one of the most tone, tone deaf things yeah. I've ever seen from any social media Unreal. team in the world. Loved it. Unreal. And then like God's hand me layups on the way back from the Uber, I tweet this out. Have you seen what the Jets sell? Yeah. The no. Jets have 50 Ch- year championship, championship reserve, reserve wine. <laughs> it's like in the front oh, no. of a wine store. Oh, so no. I, I tweeted it's everything. Dead. It's just... I am having, I like it actually. Other fan bases now, I, so I've, the Steelers and the Jets, they're just like, please stop. Like, that's what they're writing underneath my tweets. They're like, come on, enough's enough. Like, dead <laughs> serious. I love it. I love it. Yeah, they're calling uncle. I even, I'm, I went after everybody. I sent Chris Long, somebody photoshopped a dog mask on Brady. I'm like, can we do this? I just love it. I love this time of year right now. Um, but what's more pathetic, honestly, the 50-year reserve or the Steelers? No, the Steelers, come on. Steelers. So you Steelers. can still the wine, celebrate, uh, there, you can there, celebrate there, championships. And there's wine is the thing. Eh. Yeah. The Steelers being like yes. flexing about That's the Pro ridiculous. Bowl. For the Steelers, a, fr- a storied franchise. Yeah, it's tell, you hate to see Several it. Super Bowls. They have six as a franchise. Right? Yeah, like the that. six Brady, crazy. If Brady, if they, the Steelers may stop to exist if Brady ties them by himself. Like that is, That's you talk to a Steeler fan for more than yeah. seven seconds, yeah. and that Six comes bird. up. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that'll be good. Um, last night in the NBA, uh, Devin Booker, G. Gorgi, O'Dang, um, Diang. That actually, you were that was close closer enough. than normal. You yeah. played at Iowa State, right? That was uh, yes. Louisville. No, you're thinking of um, fuck. What I know who oh, you're I thinking know of, the Louisville and guy. I know who you're thinking of. He's the. That's what That's I thought this guy? guy's name was. What? You're talking about the the well, guy who, who's. What? That's the Iowa State guy. He was slow as shit. Giorgio but he hit threes. It's like the same fucking name. Yeah, yeah, Gordy that is the same name. That's the for same. You, for you, that's the exact. Yeah, it's yeah, the exact same, like the same name. name. Anyway, so these I'm guys get in a fight and then like both sprint into the yeah. locker room. Like they so meet me in the locker room and they both sprint there. Um, Giorgio Dang said they were trading jerseys, which yes. is a good like answer. Uh, they didn't fight though, did they? I don't know. Nobody in the NBA ever actually fights, right? That's a great move. It is a great move. Did you see, though, the best move from the NBA last night was, uh, who was it, Nur- Nur- Nurkic? Nur- yeah, he, he called uh, Westbrook West Brick. <laughs> he can't come back from that. That is pretty good. That's like Westbrook uh, that's Westbrook. Ravel school of <laughs> Yeah, taunting. but that's like one of those dumb things Westbrook. that you say now, like, like Westbrook that, is now yeah. Westbrook. If, if there was a reason, so we could put that on a yeah. t-shirt and it was Yeah, out. Westbrook. Yeah, Westbrook, pretty good. Um, Quick question. I saw this. Uh, maybe Hubs tweeted it. Grand Canyon University. Oh, yeah. I, I've been sleeping I, on these guys. Oh, I didn't even realize they were. I, I know it's who they Thunder are. Thunder Dan. What? Thunder Dan's the coach. Yeah, but like, oh, wow, it's that an, sounds like a fake university. Well, it Grand is. Canyon yeah. University. It's, it's, but I think it's, it's. But it's not. It's like the in, University of Phoenix, though. It's isn't a, it? It's the essentially school. like. Oh, they no, have they changed. No, they got no, like no. a rebrand. It's totally different than University of Phoenix. Who is it? Completely wrong. That it is. It is in Arizona. It's in like I think Scottsdale or one of those. It's basically <laughs> what I would thought that the Grand Canyon is this yeah. what has to be. What I would say is I no, think I, I think up. the vibe I got from it is that it's basically Florida Gulf Coast it's for in, Arizona. It's in Phoenix. Like okay. well, rich kids they, go to it. What to they change okay. the name? Out. I mean that scene is awesome. Awesome. They've and been Thunder doing it for Dan a while now. Yeah. Are they any good? Yes. Yeah, they actually are scrappy and they play in this random they mean the tournament. Conference. They could. They could make it. That would be dope. You get that scene. 
I feel like, like they, last, that, I feel that, like that last crew year, travels. Maybe two years ago, they were in the championship game in their okay. conference. I can see what happened here to me. I can see what happened too. It's in Phoenix. So you Grand Canyon University, University, a private nonprofit Christian university in Phoenix, Arizona. So it's not like, totally FGSU because it's a Christian <laughs> university. But still, Dan Marley's a coach. Largest Christian university in the school. Well, they, that's almost worse. Like, they're fucking and stuff. You know what I mean? You yeah. get some, like, oppressed religious kids. Oh, see, in nuts. Grand Canyon University, Arizona's premier private Christian university, offering degrees in, at our evening or our Phoenix campus. So I just got University of Phoenix. That's is that fake one, you. right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I got Correct. confused. Um, shout out Riggs. I think Riggs may make it here after all because he's starting to get the hint of what we do because he had another very funny college basketball. Well, Buffalo, two headlines caught you? Yeah. Buffalo, no, this Grand Canyon is hubs. Oh. But the court storming, Buffalo lost. Who they play? Northern Illinois? Yep. So they storm, and you have the ref who is sitting there trying to stop like a thousand people from storming. Very funny. Good job, Reeves, getting that. But what is this ref doing? He's so good. I mean, what's the, the ref passion, doing? like the. Yeah. With like, like no chance. Yeah. I mean, um, love it. Very I love funny. anyone who does that. Uh, anything post show? This is it. This is the last. And I don't know what we're going to, because you're Zip. gone tomorrow morning. Oh. I don't know what we're going to do for rundown necessarily Super Bowl week. because uh, To Atlanta, we're taking the RV. Oh, yep. hour. Because you're on radio 12 to 2. No, you're 12 to 2. You're 2 to 4. I'm 4 to 6. So we may have a mishmash crew, but we will be doing, obviously, everything from the Super Bowl week. Um, yeah, that's it. How's the house? Do we know? Well, Brett Merriman is so fucking stupid. Uh-oh. Here we Boy, go. Here's you just, your post show. You just fucking yeah. threw that one up there. Here you go. Just a casual question that just ruined yep. his career again. Uh, whoops. No, Brett. I mean, this is that. All right. Previous to today, I can't even remember the last time I talked to him. But today at 218, read what I said. You are so stupid. <laughs> and then he just he replied, said, what? what? <laughs> you are so stupid. Why? We have two houses that yeah. aren't remotely close to They're each other. They're not even close. They're an hour apart. I got to admit that makes no sense because hour apart. it's the Super Bowl. I should have known. We know where the Super Bowl is going to be. Pretty far in advance. Pretty, Pretty far, far in advance. advance. There, a, a bunch of people were like asking me about the houses and stuff like, are you okay Wait, with like, it's going to be like Dan and Dave are going to be here in one right. house and you're going to be in another. And I didn't look at a map or anything. I was like, I, whatever. We're like around the corner. I don't care. And then I saw a map and it was like. The bar, Dan and Dave's house, your house. Brett <laughs> Merriman. It's like, so it's not really, even So close. we got to have, like, Liam, when you asked me that, like, he's got to just sleep on the floor in the... In the or house. he's just going to yeah. have, yes. on top of it, he's going to have a long... I mean, yeah, I've, with uh, Super Bowl traffic, it's going to be, like, listen, an hour and a half to listen, get to these places. Listen, Brett Merriman is so incredibly Can we, dumb Are there any other houses and still stupid available? and idiotic. And the fact that he did that, and he lies openly, because I, I was when I found out, I was like, Daniela, how close are the house? She's like, well, Brett said 10 minutes. I'm like, can we look it up because he's a liar? She's like, well, right now, traffic says like an hour 10. You dumb son of a bitch, Brett Merriman. You are so <laughs> stupid, and you fucked over this company for the last time. Wait, can we get another house? I don't no, think not this now, hour. Like... I don't know. I mean, maybe. I feel like I'm going to go look for one right now. How can anybody be as stupid as that floppy-haired Muppet? Honestly. There's no coming back from floppy-haired Muppet. That's worse than Westbrook. So, the Super Bowl house. You You really really fucked him. I feel bad for the people. I I, I, I just asked if the Super Bowl house was cool. You really fucked him good, though. I have rejiggered the houses, so you're actually now in the close house. Um, Some of the product, like Tommy. I'm in the close house? Yeah, like Tommy got fucked. Uh, Liam, so Tommy, Spider, uh... Like, that makes no sense. Spider Devlin, needs to be... He'll just have to drive really early, and, like, it sucks for him. But the radio... He had people on radio, not next to the radio house. Jesus. Yeah, like, it would have taken me, like, an hour I'm gonna to go look for another house right. right now. That dummy Brett Merritt... And we do have the RV, which is actually nice. You wouldn't just sleep in the RV? I, yeah. I wish no, that thing kept me like going. I was trying to... I, I, I don't want to be mean to Brett, but he's just, like, how... Can you not book two houses together? Because people always have to go back and forth. You idiot. There's so much back and forth. Okay. I should have known. That's but people were asking but you, me I shouldn't have so asked much that, that I was like, I'm what? Sorry. Yeah, you really just blew that one up. I just was asking, like, was there, is there a pool and shit? <laughs> it's a nice house. <laughs> the, but there's going to be people on top of each other. Everyone. So there's the main that's every. There, that's and every. everybody has, like, their one camera guy that they need. And then people are like. I'm going to go find another house. I'm going to save the day. Hey, Brett, maybe get the two houses together, you fucking idiot. <laughs>